it's been a long time coming this. I'm 60 years old, as you know. I've been involved with England on and off and the coaching capacity since 1985. Um, I must admit it was a job I thought had passed me by. We got caught up in the last World Cup and we sort of lived in the memory of it for probably two or three years. And you just can't do that at elite level. You have to move on. Thanks very much. Great start. Can't argue with that scoreboard. 42-20. Ireland moved from Lansdowne Road to another place, but it's probably for them, or for Irish people, even more special than Lansdowne Road was. Somewhere that potentially no other England team will ever play again. We're either all together we put it right, and if anybody in the room doesn't want to, then he's free to get up and walk out now. OK? We really do need to start working hard out to make sure we get this back on the road again. We played our best rugby in that game and we scored a try. We just took them, took them off one on one and just rattled them with real conviction. It's not getting overly complex with tactics or what you try to do here, what you try to do then. We've got good enough players in this room, the midfield boys recording the right shots, giving them the direction. <laughs> We're going to give them what they deserve. A good Springbok welcome. I tried to dive like a few times, I don't know why I did it. But I dived to try to stop the ball. I felt everything about three vertebrae at my back. Click, click, click. No, burning. Okay. And what's happened to it back? Huh? 